Hey guys, I just wanted to do a really quick update on my Dutch dough nutmeg. Um, she is definitely pregnant this time. I put up a video, uh, probably one of my first videos, thinking that she was pregnant, but it was a false pregnancy because she never had kids. Um, I waited a few weeks and then I bred her once with three fall-offs and then the next day she had three fall-offs or he had three fall-offs with her again. Um, I wasn't sure she was pregnant. She wasn't really um, exhibiting any pregnant behaviors, but I picked her up the other day and her stomach was really tight. And um, I also put my hand over her stomach and I felt little baby rabbit feet kicking me. Um, I was very, very happy. And then I watched a video on how you're not supposed to pick up does because they can, you know, get aggravated and maybe have um, a miscarriage. So I won't make that mistake again. This is all a learning process. Um, and I'm sure people have successfully picked up their does and touched them and nothing happened. I guess it, it really just depends on, on preference. Um, she pulled her fur today. And you can see, like, the wind blew some of it away. So some of her fur is on, on these cages. Um, she's definitely, like, definitely pregnant. Um, ooh, she almost got me. <laughs> Not Meg is feisty. Um, she spilled, like, all her food over here. That's not poop, it's, it's food. Um, I'm just going to show you the nest box really quick. So all that fur right here, she just pulled this. Um, I'm just going to do a quick feel, but I don't know. There's no babies in there. Um, I'm thinking that there's going to be babies in there tomorrow. So tomorrow morning, um, when me and Tanner wake up at probably around 5 a.m., we'll come out here and I'll check and see if she has babies. I'm really hoping that she has babies. I'm so excited for it. And I mean, if she does, I will keep uploading videos and keep you guys updated. Cross your fingers.